What's up? This is Square2448 with the Farming Simulator 17 mod review. And today we're going to be taking a look at some John Deere mowers, a Craftsman mower, and a John Deere gator. So, up first, we're going to be taking a look at this John Deere riding lawn mower. Pretty nicely done. It does have some pretty nice detail, does have a roll bar, does have some uh, brake lights, turning signal lights, and uh, looks like a small mirror or two. And this does have a mowing deck so that you could use it to mow. The headlights look really nice on it. And the wheels look pretty okay. I might do some work on it. But look at that guys. You do have the shoot there. So let's hop on this. It's going to start right up. And uh, if you guys look closely, the foot actually moves in. And that's actually very realistic when you do uh, move. It does go in, which is awesome as you guys can see. It's pretty hard to see that it moves. But this thing goes pretty fast for a lawnmower, 8 miles per hour. I think I might be doing a little bit of work to this to get it a little bit better. But this thing rides nice and uh, looks pretty cool. But uh, we'll come over here and we're going to see how this mows over here. Now these are some pretty cool mowers that I found and all the links will be down below. So the uh, engine sounds might need a little bit of work. But this does mow very nicely. Look at that, guys. Mows nice. I think we're going to be doing a lawn care video with these very soon. But I think that we might add this to the lawn care shop. So let me know your thoughts down below. Should we add something like this to our shop? But up next, we are going to be taking a look at a John Deere Zero Turn. Now, this does have the same wheels as the other one. And it is a little bit of a lighter green and a lighter yellow. And like a lighter gray if you would say but this thing still mows and still looks really nice now the wheels seem to be a little bit further out than usual so that's pretty easy to fix but take a look guys it does not really slant upward too much since a lot of them do have that problem but we'll start this up this goes eight miles per hour does have a first person view and if you take a look it almost looks like the foot is moving but the feet are right on those footsteps which is very realistic does turn really nice and it looks like there's a little plate in the back for a hitch but I'm not sure if that exactly works and it does have a first person view which is also awesome so we are going to go to this side here and we're going to see if we could cut a little now it does have the same engine sound as the other one but I think that uh, we could definitely use this in some pretty cool videos and I did convert the other one just that this one is public. So up next we are going to be taking a look at this Craftsman mower. This thing looks really nice. I believe I did do a review of one. But this is a little bit different. Does have a nice hitch at the back. Very nice wheels. Some uh, good tires on them also. And uh, pretty nice steering wheel. Does have a few levers there. Does not say Craftsman on it. Only on this side. Not sure exactly why it's not on that side, but this thing looks pretty nice. So we'll start this up. The hat does look like it needs to be a little bit lower, but this does actually take a little bit of time to start up before you could drive it. And it does have a first person view. Look at that view, guys. It's pretty cool. And the chute does go up and down. So if you are trying to load it up onto a narrow trailer, you could easily put that up out of your way. Now, it does mow which is awesome look at that guys mows and I think that this is a very cool craftsman mower it does miss a little bit here and there that could be because I was going a little too fast or since it is old mower it might miss a little but uh, that's going to be it for the mowers now and we are going to come back and take a look at a John Deere Gator now I have gotten a lot of requests lately to get one so here it is this one was released publicly this looks very nice does have a beacon light up above uh, some winches down here very nice winch uh, decal textures nice wheels and overall this thing looks pretty cool does have a license plate and a hitch down below so we are going to start this up now this does not have a interior view does have turning signals headlights all that good stuff let's take a look at the front look at all those lights they all look nice now it does have the beacon like I was saying and the bed does not tip which is fine since uh, I thought that the tailgate might but uh, we are going to be taking this for a spin this has a top speed of 34 miles per hour it does seem to tip a lot 
not sure exactly why it wants to do that, but this thing actually has pretty good handle and other than the fact that it might tip over just a little. So the links will be down below to these, check them out for yourself, let me know down below what types of videos you guys would like me to do with these, thanks for watching, and subscribe for more!